Mirabel. How come you're here eating without serving me mine? You're even sitting on my chair. Wait, is it that you find it difficult in hearing in the morning or you have cobwebs in your ear? I said, how come you're here eating and mine is here to be served and you're sitting on my chair? Obviously, you are the one forgetting yourself. So get back on track, Perry. Never, Perry, never in your life yell at me again. Okay? Are you talking to me? Who else am I talking to? Who is standing here? You're talking to me. Yeah, they play. Just they play. You've, you've, you've suddenly grown wings, Abby. I'm talking. You're eating. Are you mad? I feel come here. Listen. Listen. You go into the kitchen and get me something to eat. Do you Just understand? Just leave me alone. Lydia, are you mad? Do you understand? But this was not part of an agreement, though. Do you understand? Yes. Good. Right now. This was not part of the contract, though. You want to strangle me? Kitchen. Nonsense. Got garnished, well garnished noodles um, and um, chicken. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. So what are you going to do now? What? You're worried, Perry. You ought to drink when you are worried. I had to talk to your dad. What's up? Well, it's still on my case with the whole marriage thing. Yeah. Why don't you listen to them? Hmm? Yes, you're 36. You are doing well. <laughs> and that makes you what, 34? Like, what's the difference between 36 and 34? <laughs> My boy. So there's a huge difference between 36 and 34. Yeah, you gotta sit down. <laughs> You're a boy. You see me yourself. So on the most serious note, guy, it's high time you get settled. Get yourself a wife, bro. That is what you preach. <laughs> that doesn't come down, doesn't concern you. He said, that is what you preach. <laughs> Somebody die. <laughs> no, but the whole thing is really getting to me. Honestly, I understand. I understand. But try as much as possible to think about what I've just said. Just make them happy. Get someone. You're a big boy, man. Not the money be your wala. <laughs> You're a small boy. <laughs> Dad, you really need to calm down. Dad, you need one more. Come on now. Uh, uh, uh. Calm down how? Don't use my name and calm down in the same sentence. Eh? You, you just opened your mouth and said you have no intention of getting married and you're telling me about being calm. Look, when the time comes... You will find who and when and where. Eh? When are you going to find one? You've never brought a woman for us to see. When are you and your brother going to become responsible? When will you take over the running of the affairs of the group of companies? When we are gone? When will you start learning to be responsible? When? Oh, are you into... Am I into... Dad, come on now, come oh. on. Why wouldn't I say that you and your brother are the same? We haven't seen any women around you people. We have not. So what do you expect us to do? What? When are you getting married? That's the question. Why won't she get worried? Why won't I get worried? Why? Mommy, I said it. I said it. When I had him, I told you this boy is too yellow for a boy. I told you. Ah, you said there's ah, no problem. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> is it not when I saw your yellow name that I married you? And I suffered in the hand of your father. It's father's better for name. women. I have had we wanted the yellow for a daughter. Yeah, but we this. don't have a daughter now. Eh? Look at it now. As his yellow, other men are now admiring him ah, and his head. head. You know I have someone. Eh? I have someone. Alright. You will 
you, you meet the person. <laughs> In two months, on my birthday, yeah, yes. bring her. Let my mind yes. calm down. You see, darling, I told you <laughs> now, the attack. apple cannot fall far from the tree, nor yes. can a lion give birth to a rat. Perry, Perry, he is the son Don't of give his me father. Heart attack like this. All right, okay, darling, no? it's okay, it's okay, hey. sweetheart. Take your let drink, us, take your drink. It's bring okay. her, let us yeah. see woman with you. Uh, yes, uh, yes, that's what we want. Hey. That's what we want. Uh, don't frown your face. I was so scared. Yeah, all those your male friends, I don't want to see them around you again. <laughs> hey, let us know the that one that we are battling how with. How can you say that? Hey. I mean, you say I'm with. <laughs> <laughs> hey, are you out of your mind? What was I supposed to do? My mom was be becoming erratic, alright? They started accusing me of things that I did not even think about. And you have to tell her this kind of lie? What the hell, man? So, what are you going to do now? I don't know. I don't know if I knew we won't be having this conversation. I don't know. Barry, you have two months. Two months. Two months, you don't have no girlfriend? Not to talk of one to take to your mom on her birthday. You have to start thinking, Perry. Oh, God. I tell you one thing, yeah? Put a call and tell them the truth. Yes. You've obviously lost the boat somewhere. How can you suggest that kind of thing? Then you have to start thinking hard. So hard because you are in a deep pot of soup. Your mom will break if you tell her this kind of lie. Then the truth. Start thinking. I bet you need to tell it, I bet. Waiter, my usual. Join you. You look bored, and I feel you need someone to talk to. Like, you know, a stranger is always better to talk to. Just get out. <laughs> okay, look. I came here because I have a lot of things on my mind. So let's do it this way. I tell you my problems, and you do the same. So I'll get rid of my problems, and then digest yours. What a great idea. What makes you even think I want to talk to a stranger? That is it, because I am a stranger. You don't have to worry about me telling on you. And well, I don't have friends. And even if I did, I wouldn't want to bother them with my problems. Oh yeah, and you would want to bother a stranger with your problems. Come on. Hi, I'm Mimi. I applied for a master's program in journalism. Well, the school sped up the whole process and I have to pay my school fees in two months. Right now, 
I do not have the money for the school fees and also to clear my debt. Your turn. What do you say? What part did you know here? My story or your turn? I have a proposal for you. And if you will agree to do it, I'll give you way more than you need to clear your debt. What? Mm -hmm. Let's hear it. Come on, come. Hey, can you at least hear me out, please? You can't just leave like that now. Are you out of your mind? Who do you think you are? Do I, do I look like a beggar to you? Look, I never said you're a beggar. But you need me and I need you, alright? I need to introduce someone to my father. Okay, all we need to do is just get to know each other better and know how to coexist, that's all. You are crazy. Come on, listen. We just need to know how to connect, that's all, please. I'm out. No, come on. Five million, that's what I'm offering. Alright, I give you two million the, the moment you move into my house and then after two months I take you to my parents, we get married, two months later we divorce and I give you a balance. I think of what that money can do to you now, or, or for you. Is this a joke? It's not a joke, how can I joke about something like this? Look, you don't have to give me an answer now, okay? This is my car, just call me when you change your mind, please. I'll be waiting for your call. Harry. Yeah, that's, that's my name. Think of what the money will do for you. Five million naira in this hard economy. Are you out of your mind, Perry? No, if there's something wrong with you, say it out. I can prove a solution. That money is enough to cover a traditional marriage. And you want to spend it on a random girl just to pretend to be your girl? Well, I don't have much of a choice. That is preposterous, guy. Let me tell you something. My parents won't let me breathe because of this whole marriage thing. So if this is what they want, I'll gladly embrace it. Nobody should stress me out big. This, this is madness. I must tell you, this is madness. Well, a man has to do what a man has to do. I tell you something, yeah? That girl won't call, she won't take your call. She will not make that call. You want to bet? <laughs> She's not going to call you because this whole idea is insane. Five million. Cool. Even if she doesn't agree, I'm sure I'll find someone else who will. Okay, it's five million, bro. <sighs> I. Sorry, I don't like this. Oh. Hmm. Hello. Hi, Perry. This is Mimi. I know. Where should we meet? Sit. Sit down. Here. Okay, first off, you obviously have a lot of money. So why are you paying me instead of getting a wife? You're here to sign a contract. Part of which is no questions. <laughs> what? We mean nothing to each other. So we have no business knowing anything about each other. I call it Paris contract. So please, go through it. Okay. We will not sleep in the same room. No sexual activities. Mm -hmm. We are both entitled to our private lives. 
You can keep your man if you have any. I really do not care. You are not obliged to do anything as a wife. Neither does Perry have any obligation to you as a husband. Okay, isn't this learning how to pretend to be couples? If we do not participate in it, how do we learn? Well, moving. And then we'll see how it goes from there. So what will it be? Are you signing the contract? What has my sleep got to do with you? Eh? Do you pass through my bed to your office? Food? Yes, you're supposed to be making food. You're the woman in the house. Hey, look. Perry, that was not part of our contract agreement. Eh? I am not obligated to do anything for you. You took two million naira from me. You won't cook? Are you kidding me? I am not. I am only here to play the pretend game. So if you need someone to do the work for you, get a maid. Okay? Because this was not part of the agreement. Ha! What kind of problem is this? Are you busy? Wait. Excuse me? What do you mean, excuse me? Perry, it is past 11.30. I was scared if something happened to you or... I don't even know. Wait, when did you suddenly see the need to start acting like my mother? Like, I don't get it. Look, I don't <laughs> like it, alright? Better stay in your limits. <laughs> Look at this one. Oh, you thought I was worried about you? Oh, no. I don't even know you. Look, I am more concerned about my balance. And if anything happens to you, I will not get it. Wait. So this is why you waited up for me? Really? Mm-hmm. Look, it is very important that you stay safe. Eh? Because ah, uh, I don't want to be in a stranger's house if something happens to him or he goes missing. It is you that will go missing. What is wrong with you? Look, I had a very hectic day out there. Do you understand? This is the last thing I need. Alright? Stay in your limits. This was not part of the contract we signed, right? Do you remember? Stay in your limits. This shouldn't repeat itself. Okay. No problem. But please, okay? You need to take care of yourself. Because if anything happens to you, hey, my balance. And if I don't get my balance, huh, it won't be funny. Okay? okay? Good night. Remember, I owe people. Hmm? Did you at least cook? Who is your maid? Did you know at Skunk? Thank God you're home safe. That's what matters. The balance is important. <laughs> mm. And I can swear she did not cook. I can swear that she did not cook. Like, don't you understand? This girl is driving me crazy. <laughs> I really don't know what you're expecting. We're supposed to be pretending. I don't even know how we're going to connect with this kind of attitude. Have you tried talking to her? Communicate, man. If you're paying her so much, 
position as well, putting the efforts. Okay, have you been listening to me at all? I don't know why, sometimes I wonder why I talk to you, I swear, because it's like when I'm talking sometimes, you just you be hearing other things. You hear other things when I talk. I just know that this person is. Okay, I might call you back. I'm, like, I'm beginning to lose it. Yeah, so I've been doing some thinking, and I have come to the conclusion that we need to put in more work to make this more believable, you know? Uh, to the best of my knowledge, I have been keeping to the end of my deal. I didn't pay you to millionaire to sit around doing nothing, all right? You need to get involved. Get involved? Yes! You, know, you need to cook for me. I need to know your style. You need to know what I love, you know? Harry! Yes! You know, go on dates. Get to know each other better. Now imagine you and I are just sitting in front of my parents and we can't even say a thing or two about each other. It doesn't even make sense. It, it only makes sense that we put in more work, all right? You need hey! To... Come on. Yes, now. We need to go on dates. You know, I get to know you, you get to know me. Go there, do this thing, get married and get it over with. Ah. Just agree. Just agree, yes, that you know, we need to put in more work and make sure that it comes out fine. And you must, if you must know, I am ready to even give you more than five million naira. If this should go well, now think of what you can do with that kind of money. Uh -huh. Okay. I know yes, I know you're a smart girl. Come on. Thank you. What is this now? It's not food I'm enjoying. Hmm? How can you be enjoying this? Look, you can kill somebody. You, you want to kill me before the contract ends? What is this? Look, Perry. This is not part of our contract. I woke up today and I went to the market with my own money to prepare food for you. And you're complaining that it's what? So that is an excuse to make this kind of nonsense. How can a grown-up woman be making this kind of food? If you can cook, go to the kitchen and cook. Okay? Cook what you can eat. Jesus Stop disturbing me. I should have known better. You want to kill me with ulcer? You want me to have ulcer, Abby? It's not only ulcer. So okay. you, you are complaining? Really? Why don't you go and cook for yourself? How can you? Go and cook. Go to the kitchen and cook. Ah. No, 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 no. Is that food not sweet? What is wrong with him? Uh uh. It's not the same thing I'm eating here. It's sweet now. I'm busy for him, Kavi. You can't just ignore people like that. I've been knocking for God's sakes. The way you talk is no way to talk to anyone. But do you see me complaining? Hmm? Mm. What do you want, Barry? Are you here to apologize to me after you, you insulted me downstairs? You're a terrible cook, alright? The truth is not an insult. You should enroll in a, in a cooking class or, or YouTube. I mean, even an idiot can learn how to cook on YouTube. Better still, meet your mom to teach you how to cook. What you made was 
was a disaster. That was peppery. That was tasteless. Harry, get out. We're going on a dinner date. Now you better be ready before I'm back. I'm not going anywhere with you. I like my women really classy. Wear something nice. <laughs> <New length. laughs> Yet you have none. Hmm? Too much taste for a man whom perhaps women do not find pleasing. Don't you think so? Ready. I'm not going to pass it. Need it. Guy, calm, calm down. Okay, calm. I'm, I'm calm. I'm calm. I'm calm. I mean, I've thought about so many things today. Just imagine I take that girl home to my parents and I boast about how good her cooking is and then she serves this nonsense. You can imagine the kind of shame that will engulf me. Guy, this, this is a very simple thing, yeah? I mean, if you like her that much, enroll her into a cooking school. Yes. Like who? How? Like fire. Somebody that I don't even get along with. Enroll her in a cooking school. Uh -huh. On whose account? <laughs> Uh, let's go. Let me get to something to cool your nerve down, man. Call me with another number now. I already paid you remaining hundred k. Hey, I'll sort you out. Please give me some time, okay? I'll. Hello. Hello. You should eat now. Oh, so if I don't eat, you will beat me up? I will never do that. Can you please eat? Must we always do this in public? Like, look, I know we don't like each other. I mean, if, if given the chance, we'll kill each other, but must you show it in public? Can you eat, please? smile. Oh God. <laughs> well, um, can you tell me the things you like? Let's have these dates like normal people now. Jesus Christ, Perry! Um... What happened? I went to your room, we're not there. How can you say sorry for, for putting me in a state of shock? We have more pressing problems. We seem to have that always, but bear in mind that I My will My brother not... is coming. He's going to be staying for a while. For a while? How long is a while? How am I supposed to know? What I'm just trying to tell you is that what I paid you for has already started, okay? Oh, we need to replan. What do you mean by that? You're moving into my room. <laughs> no, 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 you're joking, right? What do you mean? What am I saying? Which normal couple stays in different rooms? We have to make my brother believe that we're a loving couple. Do you understand? 
Yes, now. Look, you have to move into my room, all right? My brother has to think that we're a loving couple. Even though we are not. Well, that one is to you, but to him we are, all right? So you're moving into my room. <laughs> it's not debatable. It's necessary now. Why are you looking at me like that? I've had you now. You're acting like you've not heard. See, like, why are you sitting there? You need to start moving your things now. He's coming down, he's coming today. Get down there and get this over with. Hey. We'll go down there and behave like a couple. Now smile for me. Smile. You can do better. That's more like it. You, man. <laughs> ah. Oh my god, I've missed you. Brother! <laughs> oh man, it's good to see you. Mm. Look at you. Look at you, you're so buffed up. What is going ah, on? What would I say about you, Come man? Say that. <laughs> Just about the gym. What are you saying? Not me. <laughs> oh yes, um. Hi, um, Mimi. Yeah, Mimi. <laughs> Mimi, nice. She's prettier than you said. You are so pretty. Ah. Thank you. My name is Dochi. <laughs> Nice to meet you. Well, nice to meet you too. Welcome to the family. Thank you. Brotherly, you. Mm, I know, I know. <laughs> nice. I know. Hey, I'm so famished. Tell me something. Right? The dining is set, alright? Let's just hit right like to it. <laughs> They'll grab your bags later. Okay, okay, my bags later. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Woo! You got it, bro. I know. No, no, no. This is good. This is it's a lie. Man, this is good. Yeah. <laughs> Mm -hmm. But Perry, mm -hmm. what changed? You were never keen on finding a woman. A good woman told you. A good woman made me change my mind. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. So, how was your flight? Oh. Stressful, but I'm here, right? <laughs> of <course>. That's good. <laughs> Who made this? Of course, I you did. did. <laughs> she did. This is this is this is good. Thank you. This should be the best meal I've had in a long time. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. Perry, Perry. Hmm? So this is what you've been enjoying. What can I say? <laughs> My brother. <laughs> You say go. <laughs> so welcome to the family. Thank mm. you so much. <laughs> oh. Well, you know what to say? The way to a man's heart mm -hmm. is through the stomach. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. What are you doing? What do you mean? What was, what was wrong with me? What was the meaning of that? I paid you to come and be loved up with me, and what was that nonsense you were doing? Oh, wait, so what I did down there wasn't loved up enough, hmm? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Were you expecting us to make out in front of your brother so he would believe us? Listen to me. You were here for a reason. Do not feel me. Do you understand? Yes. Do you understand? 
Perry, are you in there? Yeah, sure. I'll be downstairs. You get to join? Of course. Yes. of this madness. I will refund this money and get out of here. What kind of problem is this? just died. Shut up. Your mother died two years ago and I lent you money for her burial. It's been over a year now and you're avoiding me. Please, I'm begging you. Eh? Give me little time. I will sort you out. Please. Time? I went to your house, Mimi. Your landlord was there for his rent and he's threatening to throw you out. Oh my God. Pay my money, Joe, or else anywhere I see you, I am locking you up. But... What kind of problem is this? No, I'm impressed, for real. I see you have something good going on here. It's good. So tell me, how did you meet her? Um, <laughs> you know, you, you just got back. Shouldn't you be resting upstairs or chilling, you know? Three years. I've not seen my younger brother and you want me to be resting. Hell no, bro. You should be giving me updates. <sighs> Because I know you. you. You're not a preacher of love and all of a sudden, you're a relationship person. Nah, talk to me, bro. What happened? How did you meet her? Well, um... Mm. <sighs> well... <laughs> we just met. Oh. Yeah, we just met and we, we clicked and here we are. <laughs> that is good. Mm. So have she met mom and dad? Nah, but she will. Why? What are you waiting for, bro? If I had such a woman, she's meeting mom and dad the next day. Mm. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> what about Sharon, your girl? Uh, 
Sharon, ah, you know, being engaged to a woman doesn't mean that the both of you will finally end up married. True, yeah. true, true, yeah. She left. Yeah, for whatever reason, that's her business, I don't know, because I kept my own side of the, you know. She left, she found another person, so, yeah, I know. Oh my God, I... I didn't know. It's okay. I'm so sorry. Uh huh. So, have you told mom and dad? Ah, uh, <clears throat> no. No. And let's keep it that way, okay? I love my peace of mind. Okay. Maybe till I find someone else, just let's keep it that way. <laughs> women. Sorry, man. Uh, you know, women, they are like butterflies, they fly. But I'm super happy for you. Yeah, truthfully. This love my time. No, you have a good girl. I mean, that food was amazing. Uh, was. Yeah, maybe food wise. Huh? Well, you never could tell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> good morning, you're up. You scared me. I'm so sorry. I hope I didn't start with you. I mean, uh, I'm an early starter. Let me help. I me. Mean, oh, no, no, no. It's, it's fine. I can do this. I insist. Come on, you are a guest. Guest? Uh-huh. <laughs> you are the guest. We're about to welcome you into our family. <laughs> so, Perry, he's not up? Um, he's, he's tired and um, so he decided to take a leave so he can spend some time with his brother. Hmm. Okay, so you traveled from Abuja to Lagos just hmm. to see your brother in the middle of the year? Mm. I wouldn't say I didn't miss him. I did miss him, but no. I came to monitor my project. I have this building project. It's at its finishing touch. You know these workers, if you're not there, they mess you up. So that's it. Oh. What about you? I see you both are crazy in love. I like that. I like that. <laughs> Especially for Perry. <laughs> that <Yeah>. boy. <laughs> you know, everyone needs a spice or two of love in their life. <laughs> you are correct. So... I have to go dress up and leave. Uh, you guys shouldn't bother about me. Have fun. Because I'm going to be at the site all day. Alright? It's fine. <laughs> hmm. You're welcome to the family. Thank you. Please, just. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Alright. So that was what happened. Okay. I was just waiting for you to come back so that we would, you know, talk about it. Alright, that makes sense. That's, uh... There you are. Hey babe. Come, come, come. Come, come. Hey. Sit. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, babe, did you hear what my brother just said? What? What did he say? So I got the both of you something, but I was scared if it's going to be to your taste. Oh, it's fine. I promise I will love it regardless. Fantastic. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I, ladies first. After the gentleman. Yeah, of course. I got you this one. Oh it's a God. handbag and some other good things inside. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, bro, uh, <clears throat> you already know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, you really didn't have to bother, you know? You're our guest now. Hey, mm -hmm. come on, it's nothing. You know mm -hmm. who come here empty-handed? <laughs> I just wanted to appreciate you for being in my brother's life. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, too. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice. You should actually be getting these things for more and more. You know I can take care of my oh, That's so thoughtful of you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Glad you like it. Yes. You know, this is the first gift you're getting from the family. 
Mm. Mm -hmm. Well, thank mm. you. <laughs> mm. Nice. All right, saving the best for the last. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is for you. Oh, really? Thank you so much. Mm. <laughs> you. Mm -hmm. you nice. I'm glad you like it. I yeah. do. Thank you. you. Both look so good together. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Um, this is good. I can see you've really been happy a lot these days. Okay. Okay. Really? My brother's just been here for a few days and you're already warming up to him. <laughs> Wait, isn't that much you're paying me for? To warm up to your family? He's your elder brother, so he is. The contract covers him too. No. You knew very well that I didn't want you to take the gift and yet you took it. And who are you to determine that? Hmm? I see the way you look at him. <laughs> what is your problem? Are you scared that I may be so good at the job? Hmm? I'm trying to win your brother over so he can accept us as a couple. Or are you intimidated? I do not like how you... <laughs> Look, I do not care what you like or don't. The contract clearly states that I can do whatever I want to do. With my brother. <laughs> what am I doing with your brother? Is smiling with him being intimate? Hmm? Look, it is stated that you wouldn't bother me. And I will not bother you. Look, darling, please do not question me. And I will not question you. <coughs> See, hey, if you dare lay your hands on me, eh? <laughs> you will leave this room in a body bag. Try it! Nonsense. I hate you. Hmm. And if you had a woman that loved you, would I be here? Forget that. Hmm? That's why you don't have anyone in your life. I'm sure your mother has a problem with you. Since you have a problem with women. Bastard. Oh, Post boy, my joy, Jerry. Oh. <laughs> this is so beautiful. Yeah? The brother is so nice. Who gave birth to this boy? You know, everyone needs a spice or two of love in their life. <laughs> hey, what's up? Is everything okay? Yes. Oh. I thought you went out with Perry. Oh no. I I decided to stay. Okay. Is everything okay though? Everything is fine. No, no. I don't think so. I mean, I saw you lost in thoughts. We're basically gone. Is everything wrong? Anyways, I, I wanted to step out to get some air. I don't mind if you come with me. Oh, no, I, I don't think Perry will be okay. Oh, Perry will be fine. Come on, he's my kiddo. He'll be all right. I would love it if you go with me. I'll, I'll be fine. 
Besides, you still have to tell me what is wrong. Hmm? And if you refuse to tell me, I'll keep asking. <laughs> okay. You are too kind. Let me just change up. I'm here. Okay. <laughs> Chidi, please, what is funny in what I just said? <laughs> I paid a girl to pretend to love me, mm. to throw my parents off my back, and you are laughing. What is funny? Okay, okay. All right, I'm sorry that I laughed, but what has she done this time? That she's woman with a brother? So? So? Chidi, so? Yes. The contract says both of you can do what you please. You don't even like this girl, so why are you stressing it? The contract says both of us can do whatever we please and not messing around with my brother. With whoever, whoever, whoever the person, but not my brother. Come on, I'm even surprised you're even supporting her on this one. What's your problem? Why wouldn't I support her? I don't see anything wrong with what she's doing. What I see is your ego. And let me, let me tell you something. She's keeping a part of the contract which says she has to do whatever it is to make you love her, make your family love her, and that's it. Or did you catch them doing anything? So why are you expecting something oh, that's... Wait, 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 wait. So, so I have to wait till I catch them doing something? <laughs> really? Look, I did not pay her to come and be cozying around with my brother. All right? I see the way she, she acts when she's around him. She's always so comfortable around him. I did not pay her to come and entertain me. She has a job to do, and that's what she's going to do. That girl does not own you any loyalty. Okay? Her job is love you, make your parents accept and love her, you get married to her, you divorce, and she's out. So don't expect anything else. What if at the end of the day, it turns out that I'm right? What if at the end of the day, she fails me? You have said it to yourself. I tell you something. This is a girl that has debts to pay. Normal girl cannot jeopardize her chances of living a better life. So my guy, relax. Come on, relax. <laughs> Waiter! Because... I'm sorry I had to break down in front of you. It's okay, I mean... The place is empty. It's cool to unwind sometimes. You don't mind? No, not at all. I mean... I do cry sometimes. It helps. You know, tears are actually therapeutic. Thank you. Really, thank you so much. You don't have to thank me. I'm, I'm sorry about your mother, about everything. So what is Barry doing to help? Uh, you, you know the wedding is coming up soon and okay. I don't want to pile up my responsibilities on him. Resp what responsibilities? I mean, that's why you are a couple. It's not a big deal, okay? He needs to know. He needs to know about everything, about your landlord, your school, the debts from your mother's pleasure. He needs to know. He must come in. I don't want to pressure him. Hey. Please. At least tell him. That's why you're a couple. He needs to come in. He needs to be there for you. I'm sorry. Uh, it's alright. I... I'll talk to him. I will. You will be fine. I'm certain of it. Okay? Thank you. 
It's all right. See, it's not that bad to talk. <laughs> but truthfully, I I admire you because you are strong. That's Thank good. Clearing your throat for the past two minutes. If you want to say anything, say it. You're not a child. Well, look, I just need to unwind. There are too many things going on right now, and I'm trying to figure it out. I don't even know. Wait, 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 wait. Aren't we all going through stuff? You think you're the only one going through stuff? I am going through stuff. We're all going through stuff. So what are you saying? Perry, I just need you to listen. I just want to talk to someone. I pay you five million. And you also want me to do the job of a therapist, really? Harry! Bring your voice down. Do you know what I go through when I go to the office? I see shit at the office. And then I have parents that are breathing down my neck, putting pressure on me to get married, even when I'm not ready to. Now that's not to mention all the things that I go through. Harry, it's fine. Forget it. I no, won't no, no, bother no, no, you no. anymore. You are going to listen to me. Do I disturb you with these problems? The least you can do is to be nice. I just need you to listen, that's all. It won't hurt you. My ears. It hurt my ears, Mimi. Now that's me being nice. <laughs> like, what are we even talking about? I paid you two million, didn't I? From the five million I was supposed to pay you. Why don't you engage the services of a therapist if you need someone to talk to so badly? Yes, you have money. Get a therapist, talk to the therapist, and leave me the hell alone! Can I even have peace in my house? I'm dealing with a lot. You invading my space is a lot. I just, unfortunately, I can't do anything about it because of the kind of parents I have. Please, I'm going through a lot. Harry, it's fine. Keep going through your a lot, and I'll handle my a lot. Yes, every man to his own a lot. Good girl, now you're reasoning. Sex with you. I'm not having sex with you. What will I do with your sex? I'm just saying that we should mourn, all right? Let my brother think that we're a lovely couple, like we're having sex. Like, oh! You're insane. Can you just do this thing? Like, oh! 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 Join me. Oh! Oh! Yeah, baby! Join me! Oh! Yeah! Oh! Is that trash? You need help? Oh no, it's <laughs> dirty clothes. I'm taking it to the laundry. Oh. Is the place far? Because I, I can drop it. Oh, no, no, no. It's, it's fine. I can do it myself. Are you sure? Yes. <laughs> I mean, I can help. I mean, we're family now. <clears throat> this. 
Ah, uh, are you ready? Yeah, bro. But I'm ready. You good? Uh, is everything okay down here? Yeah, everything is okay. Yeah. We're good. All right, we should go so we can beat traffic, okay? Yeah. Why don't you drop the laundry since we're going out together? I mean, we can drop this off. What laundry? Oh, look, don't worry, okay? I'll do it myself. Look, the laundry is five streets away from here, all right? And we are going the opposite direction. I'm sure you can walk to the laundry, right, baby? Yes, honey, I actually like walking. Yeah. <laughs> I enjoy it a lot. <laughs> it's not like you get to exercise. You know? Yes. So, so you see? <laughs> yeah. Right, hold up. You know what? <clears throat> you take my car key, you can drop it off with my car, okay? Since we're going with Perry's car, it's all right. R really? Yes, I insist. Okay? Unless you want to use Perry's car. Oh, no, no. <laughs> this is fine. Thank you so much. <laughs> Sorted. Thank okay. you. Okay. Uh, hey, hold up, bro. Take it easy. Such a nice man. Yeah? Who like that is Ingrid's brother? Come here. Oh, yes, I forgot this in the kitchen. Come on. Just <clears throat> Okay, so what are you looking for? Tochi? Hmm? You want him to feed you? You want him to clothe you? You want him to come bathe you? What do you want, Perry? Where are you coming from? That is none of your business. You have no business asking me that. This is my house, alright? I have a right to ask you anything. Besides, it's past 8 p.m. All right, you went out with my brother's car for God's sakes. And what? Huh? Oh, <laughs> you, you were scared that I took off with your brother's car? Is that how low you see me? I do not know you anything is possible. Look, you might have paid me, but I am not your child, okay? Oh, God. I saw how you looked when he offered his car this morning. Something you will never do. Well, why would I? No, tell me, why would I? I owe you nothing but three million naira. Good! So please stick to the contract! I do not like the way you are friendly with my brother. <laughs> you are not supposed to take anything from him, and you know that. <laughs> so, why don't you go tell him yourself? Hmm? Are you scared? Oh, you're scared that he might see your insecurities? You do not know me. I know you enough to know that you are mean and unkind. You owe me nothing, but you owe people out there a little kindness. You're delusional, Mimi. <laughs> Look, I know you were scared because your brother seemed to be something you will never be. He is kind. He is caring. You know what? After this whole, this rubbish, I will make sure someone like you live my life for good. Rubbish.
Mom. I've been calling you all day. Huh? Look, uh, uh, Tochi was here earlier. So your father and I wanted to hear from you. I'm fine, Mom. Mm, okay. How is our daughter-in-law? Mom. What? See? I've told all my friends about her already. Everybody's relying on you. Don't just disgrace us. <laughs> Mom, don't do that. Perry, I'm happy for you. Family life will really suit you, eh? I can imagine you with little, little babies running all around. Oh. <laughs> you take my car key. You can drop it off with my car, okay? Since we're going with Perry's car, it's all right. Really? Yes, I insist. Positioned yourself strategically so that he'll come back and see your pathetic self, right? You thought he was going to come back last night. You want to destroy my couch, my very expensive couch? How would you even know how expensive it is when all you do is all up and down? Are you out of your mind? Is it me you're talking to? Is there anything I have said that is wrong? Don't you owe everyone stressing the hell out of my life? Look, let me tell you something. I'm stepping out now. If I come back here, listen, if I come back here and I find you here, you will not believe what I will do to you. And I'm not joking. Nonsense. You don't know anything. Is it, where, where I got the mannequin is not better than this one. Nonsense. You know, I'm still trying to understand what this means. Like, I don't understand. Is this some sort of joke? A joke? Perry, I'm trying to help and you're calling it a joke. Your girl needs help. She has debt. The girl is suffering. House rent, school fees. She's in debt for burying her mom two years ago. Come on, man. She needs it. I just want to help. Wait. You didn't know? What did you call her? You called her my girl, right? It only means that she is my responsibility. Mrs. Why would you want to give a girl two million naira? A girl that you don't even know? I don't need to know anyone to extend my hand of kindness. You know me, Perry. Besides, she's going to be your wife. My younger brother's wife. It doesn't matter. She doesn't need to know you got this from me. I just want to help. Give it to her. I'm done with this shit. All right? I'm done with this shit. You're going back and you're going to be staying at Dad's place from now. I don't want you around. I don't want you at my place again. 
you understand, until I calm down. Because I can't, I'm not having this. I'm not having this at all. Daddy, what is wrong with you, bro? That girl is suffering. She's even thinking about you. reason she's not bothering you. You have your wedding to plan and everything. She knows that. I'm just trying to help. I want to make it easy for the both of you. Take, give it to her. She needs it. For both of us? Or for her? Come on, man. You know you can't throw me out of the house, right? I mean... You know what? You might be my elder brother. But that house is my house. Okay? And I say that I don't want to see you there. Until I want you to come, I'll let you know. Are you, are you serious? I don't want you in my house again. I'm sorry. Babe. You're not serious, man. Come on. I'm just trying to help, all right? Telling my brother all your problems, huh? Somebody that has been here for barely a few weeks, and I'm here, you couldn't even talk to me. Problems that you never wanted to listen to. Please get out. Wait, look, we have a contract, all right? I understand that, but did you have to drag my brother into our affairs? Sorry. What did you just say? Our what? God forbid. I never want to have anything to do with somebody like you. You are. Evil and wicked. No wonder you do not have a girl in your life. Are you talking to me like that? Yes. You don't say! What? So this is it. You paid her to act as your girlfriend. Reason you never really cared about her. Bro, this is not your business. In fact, get out of my house. Hey, 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 hey! I'll leave, if that is what you want. But I'm not going anywhere without her. What? Are you high? Am I high? Have you lost the boat? You paid her to get into this contract. Yes. Good. I'll pay you back everything. Look, I don't need your money, all right? We have a contract, all right? And it's binding. I'm supposed to be taking this girl to see our parents in a few weeks. Mimi, come with me now. Okay. Look at this guy. Oh, would you rather stay with him and see this contract through? Contract that has cost you nothing but embarrassment and harassment. I'm, I'm not trying to. This is your choice. I'm not going to force it on you. Hey, 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 listen. We have a contract, all right? We're almost there. You can't leave now. You can't leave now. Look, I'll add more money. I'll add two million, three million, four million, five million, any amount you want. Hey! Please. I'm sorry, but. This is over. What do you mean all of this is over? We have a contract. There is no way that is stated that the contract cannot be terminated. Come on, there are all set rules. I didn't need to write everything in the contract, but yes, there is a contract. All right? Perry, like I said, you are a mess. And this, it's over. Come on, what do you mean it's over? We're almost there. We're almost there. Come on. Let's go. She just called me a mess, though. Just, these people just come on. Hey, uh, <laughs> yeah, take some water. I shouldn't be here. This is your parents' house. It's fine. My dad, he took my mom out on a trip. 
I know his birthday is coming up soon, so it's no problem. They're not around. <laughs> Besides, even if they're around, they rarely come up here. They always stay downstairs. You know? Sorry. I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to cause any trouble. Hey, hey, Mimi is fine. I understand. It's perfectly okay. Hey, it's fine, alright? You are fine. Uh, no, don't, don't. Hey, it's okay. It's fine. It's... Don't cry, okay? Come on, Kai, come on, stop this. What's going on with you? What's what's wrong? I feel them, bro. I feel them again, my parents. Because of a woman? Come on, this is not about, this is not just about bringing home a woman, all right? This is about making them happy. For once. Oh, not again. Come on, not again. Look at Tochi. Tochi builds them a house. I mean, even in as much as they have so much already, they have properties everywhere, he still decided to surprise them with a house. This is not a competition, and you know it. Well, it is, all right? And I don't have a problem with that. I don't have a problem with that. Tochi has master's degree, he has PhD, he surprised my dad with a new house, he even opened a new business for my mom. And what do I do? Nothing. And then the small thing, the only thing they've asked me for, which is bringing home a woman, I have failed. I told you since from onset that Pei Mimi wasn't finding a wife. I told you. Well... I thought somewhere along the line, you know the way they say it in movies, I thought that we're going to fall in love eventually, you know, but... Fall in love? What? What do you mean by that? They do it in z World and tell all those Telemundo now. Look, stop this. I would advise you, tell them the truth. Apologize to your mom, apologize to the girl. Alright? Look, marriage is something of your own. It's for you and you alone. You're going to be the one to bear it, not anybody else. Tell them the truth. Come on, you know how... You were, you were not there to take my mom. It's, it's, it's okay, bro. Come on. Why come are you on. taking my It's okay. Drink? Let's let's no. go home. Enough, enough. Let's go home. Wait, I need more drinks. It's a lie. He doesn't need any drink. Let's go home. I'm not going anywhere. I want to drink. I'll drag you. Don't let me drag you. Okay. I'll leave this thing. Okay. Like, let's go home. Hell? Okay, let's go home. Come on. Let's go home. Uh, Check of five million there. What? Five? Why? Because I want to help. Because I. I like you. I like you a lot. No, the truth is. I love you. I just, 
I just want to be here for you the best way I can. I just want you to know that I'm here. this it's too much and I can't even pay you back mm -hmm. I have a lot of debt right now and I've not even sorted them out how will I pay you mm -hmm. I, I, I don't need you to pay me back I don't expect you to pay me back per Perry told me he gave you two million and I've paid him back that already look I'm not trying to hold this money against you. It's not a must you, you date me. Because you're still going to keep this money no matter what. Because I want you to be fine. You deserve it. I just wish you... You give me the chance to show you how much I love you and how much I, I want to care for you. I hope you give me a positive answer. I was wondering when you would finally ask. Yes, I will. <laughs> Dad? I like that paint they were using. Ah. Ah. Um. Good day, sir. Good day, ma. Is that our daughter-in-law? Huh? She's so beautiful. <laughs> sit down, my dear. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. Thank sit down. Ah. Uh. Dad? Yes, yeah, mom. Harry told us everything. And we understand. Your father and I are sorry for pushing him when he was not ready. Yes. What? Yes. Yes. We're really sorry. We're sorry. We apologize for pushing you into taking lifelong decisions in the haste. And then from now onwards, we will allow you to take your time and do your thing the way you want to do it. And we'll back you. <laughs> yes. Uh, no, be a be a Perry. Come, 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 come. Come, your brother is here. Uh. <laughs> What's up? Um, I know this is late. I mean, I should have done this before now, but um, you say it's better late than never. Mm -hmm. So, I just want to apologize for everything. I know I was a mess. I'm really sorry. And you were right. I think I need to show more kindness to people. I'm actually working on that. <laughs> You're a good woman. Thank you. And it deserves you. Congratulations. Thank you. If we are going to become a family, we should at least start on a good note. Of course. <laughs> nah, nah. Go and bring that wine. Hmm? All right, let's celebrate. Okay. Yeah, I'm hungry now. <laughs> I want to taste our daughter's food. Come. Come, let's go to the kitchen. We have a lot to talk about. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. That's where I should start. <laughs> Son, congratulations, son. Congratulations. <laughs> Let him bring the wine. Aha! Uh -huh. Yes, 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 yes. So, mm. um, yes, I, I need to get more glasses. Sorry. Mm. Go on, go on, go on. Go on. Go on. 
Ah, it's a good day. It's a good day, son. It's a good day. It's a very great day. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Let me tell you too what your mom said. Yeah, she said she wanted a girl with her complexion. Mm. And I said, ah, but that's nonsense. You two have it. <laughs> she always says that. Cheers to my boys. Cheers, boys. Cheers. Congratulations. Thank you. Ah.